Hey everybody, it's Lon Seidman and we're back with the MSI QB because another viewer wrote in with another good question and his name is Conrad Genio and he was curious as to whether or not uh, it could play back 4K video content and the answer is yes depending on uh, the browser that you're using. So I've got a 4K video file for my YouTube channel here and it uh, does spin up very, very quickly uh, without any lag or anything else like that. As you can see, I'm hopping around in the video without issue. I'll go full screen with it here and then uh, maybe jump back to the beginning here so you can see how it seeks. So really does play back well. It's able to chew on that very large file and get it to work. And actually in this case, it's, it's down converting to 1080 because that is all I got to play back with here in the house. I don't even own a uh, any kind of uh, 4K television or monitor here so this is uh you know doing a little down converting and uh, able to keep up with everything quite nicely but i don't get this performance out of chrome it actually runs a lot slower in chrome uh, because chrome is really for some reason doesn't uh, work well with hardware acceleration on most of these low-end devices that i look at the asus ux305 is another example of that uh, but as you can see in ie uh, our cpu utilization is relatively low we're hovering around eight to ten percent uh, provided I don't do anything else with the computer while it's playing back. So it's definitely got uh, plenty of room to uh, play back this file and maybe do some other things in the background too. Uh, the QB does support uh, 4K output as well. So you could plug it into a 4K monitor or television to uh, be able to use the computer or just play back media files at that resolution. I haven't tested that because I don't own any 4K equipment, uh, but I might bring it to my office in a couple of days and give it a shot uh, over there just to see how it's uh, able to perform and whether or not it feels the same when I'm browsing around and doing other things. But I think it will. I, I'll tell you, this is a really nicely performing device. That Broadwell Celeron on here uh, is just amazingly fast, and it's, it's really incredible uh, what you can do with a little bit of money these days. This is just uh, continually uh, impressing me the more I use it. If you have more questions, please do leave them in the comments below. I'm happy to do some more follow-ups on this device as we uh, can explore it further together. This is Lon Seidman. Thanks for watching.